hey guys welcome back so guys today i'm going to bake cake my second daughter is actually celebrating her 10th birthday so i'm baking for her i know you guys don't know that i bake i bake very tasty cakes that i bake so i'm just going to carry you guys along from one step to the other you will see this wonderful recipe and how tasty it will come out i just wanted to try it after watching this just take your time and try it you will enjoy this cake so for today i'm baking chocolate cake so i'm just going to teach you people the procedure the full procedure so guys let's start immediately so these are the items that are needed for the chocolate cake I'm going to mention them one after the other. These are all of them, all the items needed. I think the only thing that, was, that is not here is just egg. That's the last thing I'll add on the mixture. For here now, this is flour, and this is 500 gram of flour. And this is sugar. This sugar is 580 gram. 580 gram of sugar and this is two teaspoons of salt and six teaspoons of baking soda and this is two sachets of milk this is cocoa powder and the measurement I'll be needing for the cocoa powder is 80 gram of cocoa powder this is 80 gram already measured and this is milk flavor i'll be using two tablespoons of milk flavor and this is vinegar vinegar i'll be needing two teaspoons of vinegar two teaspoons of vinegar and then this is water water i'll be needing 600 ml of water and vegetable oil i'll be needing 400 ml of vegetable oil and this is my super milk i really love this in chocolate cake it gives it that special taste and this is my preservative and i'll be using half teaspoon of it so these are the dry things. Now I'm going to combine all the dry things together so that we can continue with other things. So I'm mixing them one after the other. This is sugar. I just added into the flour. Then the salt and the baking soda. I just added them as well. Then the cocoa powder. I just added it as well. If there's a light in front of me, I swear that I can't see it anymore. When will I Next is the sachet milk. I'll find my way back home. I'm in the thick of a crisis. I keep searching, keep trying. Fear of the unknown is blind And one day I know this chapter Is gonna have a title And I'll finally understand why I've been going through this spiral Cause tears running down my face Don't think that I'm okay Stuck here in a struggle Then the milk flavor And the next is the preservative. That's what I'm adding here now. So I'm just going to mix all the dry ingredients before I will continue with the liquid ones.
So now I'm going to start with the liquid items. This is the oil. I just put in the oil. The next is the water. I hope you still remember the measurements. I've already told you guys the measurements for each of them. So after adding the water, next is the wise vinegar. That's what I'm adding now. Next is the white vinegar. That is what I'm adding now. So I'm going to mix the bolts together now. As you can see, I'm mixing them. Be pouring and be mixing until I finish mixing all together. you can see the mixing is almost done so the next thing I'm going to add now is the eggs so I just have to whisk them take my time whisk them and then pour into the butter so I'll be pouring it and the mixing as well If there's a light in front of me, I swear that I can't see it anymore. Somebody show me where to go, cause I'm so lost in the middle of the dark. Just hoping for a sign, when will I find my way back to the light? So I've missed all together now. As you can see, See the texture, how it's looking. So the next now is my wonderful super milk. My obonge super milk. I don't joke with. So I didn't use vanilla flavor here at all. So I just decided to use the super milk. It's optional you just use what you want you can decide to use the boots so but here i did not use vanilla flavor or butterscotch any of them i didn't use them i just decided to use the super milk so you can also decide to use just the vanilla and butterscotch the rest of them you can also use the boot. So all depends on all depends on how you want it. For me, I decided to use the super milk and leave um, vanilla flavor and the rest. So that's just it. So the next is just to pour it into the pan. But before now, I've already lined the pan. I've already lined it and put some oil on it. You can also use butter, that's margarine, and um, apply on the pan with flour before you pour in the butter. So now it's time to bake. It's almost ready, just remain in the center to dry. So I'm just going to allow you for some time before we continue. So here is the final result. Though I didn't take you guys along with the butter icing, 
that will be in another video i will show you guys how i prepared the butter icing for but this is the final result so we are ending it here for today guys remember to subscribe like and share this video and thanks for your time